Hey guys, it's Gaddy here. Uh, I'm going to be making a new series on a game called Celtic Heroes. Um, it's going to be a let's play, obviously, just like my World of Warcraft let's play. I'm going to be going from level 1 to max level, which is I think 230 or something like that on this game. I'm not too sure. Um, but this game is free to play, but you can buy uh, a currency on the game called Plat, where you can buy like chests and stuff you can open up and then you can sell these items to people uh, through the money that you can make as a free to play character. So everything you can, everything you can buy with money, you can buy with gold that you can earn through the game. So in my opinion it's still... Half, it's it's a half and half game. Um, you can buy your way to, like, you can buy your way, sort of to max level. I'm, I think, but you still need to play the hours into the game to get to that level. Which, in my opinion, I think it's more fun if we just play. Um, obviously, I would do a couple of videos like chest openings and stuff like that. But for now, I'm just going to be playing for free. So what I'm going to do is make a character, as you know if you've watched my World of Warcraft let's play, I am a warrior and I hear you can deal wield on this game, so what I'm going to be doing is playing a DPS warrior, I know it starts off as a shield, but you can get rid of it as you go in through the game. So what we're going to do is make a character, we're going to go into the face type here, now let's change our skin color so we can see. And there's a hairstyle over here. So there's not much customization as it is a mobile game. Um, this is an iOS game and Android game that you can get on the App Store or I think it's Play Store or Google Play, whatever it is. Uh, it is called Celtic Heroes, so you can play it on your phone wherever you like. Um, but if you want to play it on the computer, you need to play it as an Android. I think you can do cross-platform now, so you can still play with me if you like. I'm going to be playing on uh, the Realm Sullis, I think it is. S-U-L-I-S. So, yeah. Let's choose his face type. Um, ooh, that looks nice. It's like a Japanese warrior or something like that. Oh, Braveheart. Yeah, let's go Braveheart. He's a warrior. Uh, size. I'm gonna go small because I am a small man in real life. Hair color. Uh, let's go with blue because that is my favorite color. Beard. Oh, we're going for the more, full manly beard. We'll do that in uh, the black. We look like we dyed our hair. Is that black? I don't know. Oop, that might be more of a black. No, that's like a blackish brown. I'll go with that. So we're gonna be naming the character. Get it. V, so if you see me in game, make sure to say hello. This is the realm I'm going to be playing on. Uh, Solus, I think it is. That's how you pronounce it. S U L I S. Um, and I think it's cross, it's cross platform now, so you can play iOS and Android together, which is awesome. I think that is beautiful that they've done that. They should do that for every single game, other than like weak regions and stuff. I don't think this there is regions on this. Um, I didn't get the choice of that, so yeah. Let's get right into it. Um, I've set up my keyboard. Uh, you can do that with the app that I'm using. It's called Bluestacks, I think it is. Yeah. So, do that. Oh. so let's attack these wolves. I did make a character just to come in here and test the movement system and uh, test recording so I did get to like level 10 just to try it out make sure it records all fine I'm going to be doing like 15 to 30 minute videos I'm not too sure uh, we'll just see how it happens I'll probably record uh, 15 minute videos just for now um, and then go on I might even actually record 30 minute videos at the start because um, I hear it gets really, really hard. You need like elixir potions and stuff, and to get elixir potions, you need to grind. Now, a friend told me that what you want to do is you want to kill all these guys to get to like the next level. Just make it easier for yourself. So I'm gonna be doing that. 
kill these guys right here. I swear the wolves must drop you more XP because when I did this before, testing it to level 10, I was doing this a lot faster. Now, there is a, a couple of YouTubers that I've seen play this game on this server. That's why I've picked it, just uh, so I can have some friendly faces. Now, I don't know these people, but um, I'm watching a YouTuber called Ace. He is from Australia as well, so we're gonna maybe I'm gonna see if I can play with him or something. I'm not too sure. We'll have to see. Now, the only problem that um, I've been told with this, like, using this app is you can't talk to someone and then it, it like deletes all your key bindings so you have to play everything with a mouse which sucks um but you know the only way to the way to fix that is you have to like go out of the game and reopen it which you know is fine but for if you see me in game and i'm recording i probably won't say hello back um i might wave to you or something but i'm not gonna say hello back if I am recording just so I don't have to end the recording and um, restart it. Well, look, um, as you can see there is a lot of people still playing this game like um, when I did my like going to level 10 just to test it I seen a lot of people oh, what's going on here it's connecting to my other monitor when I went across <laughs> so it's a full game. I'll click on this go that we're level 3 a level already it's a pretty fast game got a nice helm oh now it's gonna wreck our hair how do we change that fashion or something oh, show head gear so you've got equipment um you've got a headpiece you've got shoulder oh, i'm guessing the breastplate is your shoulders and chest you've got a shield uh you've got boots gloves uh greaves so legs and then you've got your main hand, so you've got your off hand and main hand. You've got jewelry as well, so I'm guessing neck piece, uh, like, yeah, neck pieces. I wouldn't know what these are, but rings, so that's pretty nice. You get your fashion, so I'm guessing you can get, like, well, I've seen people with, uh, like, completely different looks to their gear, like a normal game, I guess. Uh, like World of Warcraft with transbox, but I guess it's a uh, completely, get a, get a completely different set you've got a mount as well i've seen people riding around like bears and stuff you can get pets and I'm, i think this is like a saddle you can get different color saddles and stuff that's pretty cool i like that a lot now as a new player to the game i'm going to be you know i'm not really new to the game i did play on the app like the apps the app version of the game when i used to play but i used to play really like a long time ago um and I lost my account, so I was like, ah, oh, stuff it, I'll just, you know, because I wanted to play again, it's like World of Warcraft, I had to come, I just got an inch where I wanted to come back and play, so I'm going to be, you know, I was like, stop it, let me just come play now, um, on the computer, so I have to make a new account anyway, why not, just do it here, <sighs> now, you might be confused. Uh, I'm I'm a bit confused myself um, on which like what skills and stuff to put in. Since when I did play, I was a rogue, um, and I, I did have a uh, a warrior, and he was my main. Like he was my higher level, but I played a lot more of my rogue, like just running around killing things. Um. So yeah. So what I'm gonna do is just kill you guys to get to level 5 or 4, whatever it is. Um, I'm not using my big move just because it takes too long and it's probably pointless. Actually, yeah, I'll just probably easier kill them. Come here, big fella. Oh, okay, one shots them. Maybe I should have just been using that. Well, oh, well, too bad. Uh, what, what this does also is gives me, like, one gold and stuff. That's going to be a lot, like, really, really helpful. Now, there is a quest you can grab over here. Um, I'm not sure if it gives you anything, but I'm pretty sure you have to collect three of these. Um, I did this quest when I was doing my test run. Um, and I don't know what it gives you, but I know you have to collect three of them, and you, after you complete this quest, this girl here, the healer, gives you a quest to collect those. So, 
I guess you can collect them before you go and grab this guy. And bam. Now you've got a learning ability, so um, I don't know if I should have showed you the characters, but there is a, a warrior, obviously. He's a tank. There is a, you can be a DPS warrior. I'm not too sure um, how they work, but I'm going to be trying to do that as a first character. Now, as a DPS warrior, you've got a DPS warrior and you've got a tank warrior. Just like any normal game. Um, you've got a rogue, which is, I'm guessing they can go invisible, sneak around. Well, I'm not guessing, I know. They can go sneak around, kill things. Yeah, such a... Um, Yada yada yada. You've got a healer, which is a druid, I believe, in the game. Yeah, druid. I forget. Um, and they can also do damage. I'm not too sure if they are too good with DPS. I never looked into them too much. Uh, when I did play the game on the iOS, I never really got far in the game. I just leveled up by myself and, you know, had fun. But I do know druids are really, really helpful at end game. Um, I'm not too sure if you can use them as a, as a, obviously as a, like a DPS healer, like a priest or something from WoW, but I know you can. I've seen like healers do some damage in arena battles and stuff when I was playing um, on the iOS. So, what, um, what we're going to do now is, I think we have to kill these, these wolves here, the dark wolves, yeah. Um, but, like I said before, my friend told me to just kill everything until you get at least one level doing that quest. Um, even if you complete it before the quest is like done. Or whatever. I'm not sure how to, if I explained that right. He said, kill everything until you get one level, then hand the quest in even if you complete it. There you go, that's better. Now, um, I, ha I did say before that I uh, was thinking of doing a, a, a duel, like, I don't know, maybe playing with another person. Uh, I'm just going to hear this quest in, just because I'm not getting enough XP from that. Um, pretty pointless in my opinion. I'll just kill him anyway. Okay. I'll get this one level and then I'll kill these things and then... Go on from there. So they only give you like 120 XP. A little bit more would be nice. Alright, I'll just kill one of these things and then I'll probably be the next level. Next level. Uh, high enough. Oh, how about I don't attack that? It's your mana here and it's your health. That's your XP bar there if you're looking at the top. Also, if you click this here, this is your inventory, like you can support and obviously your support and options there. Your stats, skills, and abilities. All your things you need to focus on are here. You've got your shop. Let's have a look at the shop while we get our mana. These are new chests, I'm pretty sure. These are the old chests. Um, so I think like every month or something, they like bring new chests in. I, I don't know how it works. You've got your resurrection uh, idols. So if you do die, you don't have to spawn back at like these, um, these things. I'll show you. These things here, they call fragments, I think, or something. I don't know. Um, you got your sigils of health. What they do is they give you like. I'll let you read it here. Permanently boost your ability to regenerate health when you're out of combat by one tick. Each sigil health. So every single sigil you have, um, it, like, gives you one tick of thing out of combat. And I'm pretty sure they're not that rare, so. You know, people do buy them. You got your backpack expansions and your bank expansions, extra hotbar, uh, which is very helpful. Um, I might buy them, I'm not too sure, or I might see if I can buy them off someone else. Like with the gold we make. Now, I do know a couple of things, like some grinding spots such as, like, uh, what do you call it? Like, gold spots and stuff for like high level you need to be like a hundred at least to use those spots um but you know it's whatever oh i'll see if we can do this there you go now 
I think it's going to be a bit hard because plat items are a big thing in this game. Um, you know, you might be thinking whether they like pay to win items or something. Uh, essentially, if you can, um, you can muster up the gold to be able to buy these plat items from Lex. Well, actually, the Lux, Lux, Lux items. Sorry, not plat. What am I saying? Plat items are the things you buy from a shop online. Now. Uh, the Lux items, these things give you like regen and neck regen and stuff like Amis, and they're pretty helpful. Uh, those things are going to be the hardest things to attain at a low level, but it is possible if you do grind. Um, it just may take a little while, so I'll probably do all the grinding off off camera, just make it easier. Now, um, I might skip a couple of levels every now and then in the videos, but um, that's just because, you know, I might forget to record one day or something, or I'm not feeling well and I want to play the game. Now, um, when you, when I was doing my level 10 test thing, someone told me to get these crit guys um, at a low level, which I'm going to do right now, and you can do them pretty easy so what they do is it gives you like a you have to learn how to do crits that's awesome we've got like a barber shop here I'm guessing you can get different haircuts uh, those are your mounts down there and stuff like that there is an auction house in this game when I used to play there wasn't so I don't know how that's gonna work but uh, I hope that's gonna be mad so protective stance as a warrior uh, it's gonna be like one thing I, I'm gonna love uh, as a solo player unless I can find myself a healer or something like that but yeah this thing right here now I was planning on playing some music through the background of this game but the sound of this game the music the the pipe bags it's just I love uh, I like the pipe bags this is a good thing now see this thing on the map this is one of the critical strike dummies that I was talking about that guy's 100 on level 65 as you see he's got like these regen though I should kill it I think yeah I think the auction house is just up on this ramp to your left and there's the banker there as well you can see with the this thing here I think that's the banker so that guy over there is the item trainer um, for the starting locks. I can't really show you what's he what he sells because of reasons. But I'm gonna learn axe training for ten gold, um, just in case someone gives me an axe. Uh, there's a lot of generous people on the server, so they might be like, "Oh look, dude, uh, here you go, man. Here's an axe." Um, and axes are pretty good. They do like blunt damage and stuff, which is nice. So I got some new gloves. That's awesome. Equip these guys. You can't sell them, unfortunately, if they have no trade. I think that's how it works because they are on this data item, so there's no point in keeping them. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this to 40, then I'm gonna get vitality to 20. These are my two main um, stats that I have to work on as a warrior. Now I'm going to upgrade my protective stance to give me an extra 42 armor, so I don't take a beating. Now, um, my dex, my mana and is going to be one ma my main ability that I have to work on. Uh, as a as a low level, it's very important. Uh, you lose it pretty fast unless you're like a, a rogue or a, a druid, I believe. I don't know even a mage maybe i think you only have to work on like dexterity at uh, dexterity or I, I can't say it it's just called dex i'm just called dex and another stat which gives you mana and i believe let's have a look here so oh, wrong one. stats so your strength here oh, strength increases your attack damage to it as a warrior it also boosts the power of your attack skills which is why it's very important for me each point in fact increases your maximum health by 6.25 that's great it also increases the power of my support skills such as like um, my protective stance and stuff now this so focus is what you get your regen from and it gives you 
Increases your attack by one and your defense by two. That's good for rogues, I think. And uh, rogues and what's good? Uh, rangers. So rangers are like a hunter or something like that. They use like a bow. So the main character, like the main classes in this game, are warrior, druid. Uh, then you've got uh, you've got Warrior, Druid, Ranger, Rogue, and Mage. Now the Mage, um, they obviously do the most damage, just like in a lot of games. Okay, that was a quick quest. So if you, when you come down here, it's good to accept this guy's quest, because he, he used to give you a, like a necklace, that could, I think, pretty good. Now this guy up here, the Druid, he gives you like a quest that you just gotta find these around layers reach and then you get like a, a necklace so that's why I picked that quest up I'm just gonna kill these guys obviously get that extra level um, going so I got another Rappi's ring which you can just drop in a second um, now if you look at your bag obviously um, oh, I don't do that so other so this is you can sell the Jaspers for quite a lot so if you get them I think it's like maybe 10 gold or something that's pretty good for right now you can't sell the that ring you can't wear it so it's pretty pointless you can just drop it from the ground I thought this was gonna be a lot harder um, but I guess not now this armor right here this armor that she's wearing you can obtain in the game if you are nude obviously um, if you didn't know that armor I got some more boots some fresh boots, let's drop these ones. Let's go back to other, just because it's uh, not a thing. Put this on. Get an extra level. Bam, let's kill you. Easy does it. Kill you too. So th there's another person in the game that's leveling. Cory Otero. I'm guessing the people that don't have actually custom names or anything like that, they're just random people that are playing the game. I'm not too sure how that's, that works, but yeah. I don't know if they don't know they can change the name or something like that, but I'm sure they'll find out later on. Now, I'm not going to use Taunt or, so, or um, this healing ability, but I'm going to put it there for now. Let's do that. Now taunt, get out of my system, upgrade this bad boy, and then the next levels are going to go into, um, oh, I need to press that one, close this, there we go. Right, now we're going to go into this cave to complete this quest, let's go down in here. Now, I'm going to be completing, I'm going to get this quest off this girl here, all you got to do is find her dog, um, and this one right here is pretty good as well to get, all you just got to find is like three mining picks, so you just walk around the cave and you find mining picks on the ground, which is nice, it's a nice little bonus, um, you get like lesser frag, fragments or something, so that means you can teleport to those, you can teleport around the map without actually using well you don't use anything already but you have to like uh, th I think you have to have inventory space yes that's what I'm looking for you have, have to have inventory space to be able to teleport otherwise you know you can't you have to run back or, or drop something so, um, but we have the with the lesser fragments I think it's called you can teleport no matter um, like how much stuff you're carrying and whatnot. Just pull this up real quick. Didn't mean to do that. Um, other, did I get any weapons or armor? No. Alright, got another level though, so let's put that in there. 
skills, upgrade our giant swing ability. So I'm going to finish all the quests in this cave here, and then I'm going to end the episode um, for the next adventurer. The next adventure of Celtic Heroes. So let's go down here and finish this little quest line in the cave. Now I have seen people speed run this game, so yeah. Put this on because these guys are pretty strong. Like, actually, no, they're not apparently anymore. It's made the game a little too easy. Um, these guys took more damage than them in there. Oh, what am I doing? I don't think I should kill this guy. Just in case he needs to hold a bribe, I think. Oh, let's just kill him. I think I get it anyway. To the next, yeah, so streaks bribe. These are us to the next quest that she uses. Now, in there, that's going to be a main leveling spot for us, I'm pretty sure, in there. Not too sure. No, so we have to come over here. We have to get three bribes. And I remember you have to you used to be able to have to pick the bribes up from here and like over here somewhere. And then give them to like these three strangers just sitting here like it's not safe for you to be in here. And it's be like, oh come on dude. I'm gonna have to kill these goddamn crowback <laughs> or goblins. They look they look like tall goblins from like Lord of the Rings or some shit. Let's kill you. Let's pull my sleeve down. It's a bit chilly in my house at the moment. So. The girl's dog is just there, and it's a pretty easy quest, you just gotta grab her, and then she gives you a free necklace. Um, so, obviously the, the mobs as well, um, they go by level, and then they go from the stars, the three stars, and up are pretty hard to kill. But other than that, um, and they get what they, so obviously they're harder to kill, meaning they give you more XP. Um, unlike these guys. These level 1s and stuff. So we'll kill this guy and then we'll kill this level 1 and see how much different XP we get. So it's just like a 2 star. Okay, cool. Hold on. Let me just regen. So I got 373 XP from this guy and 4 gold. Let me just regen a little bit up. Pop this. It's gonna put me down a little bit, but that's alright. It lasts for a minute. Um. We come over here, we'll just grab the dog while we wait for it to regen. Now, this guy right here shouldn't take that much to kill, so we'll just do that. So he was a one shot, obviously, and he only gave us 200, so it's like a 100 different XP in 100, yeah, 100 difference in XP. So, start putting some into vitality so we're a bit buffer. As you see, how much we just got from that. Now, what I've heard, it's good to do as well. So once I get my strength to 50 and my vitality to 30, um, yeah, 30, I'm going to be doing, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give myself like 3-2 um, or 3-1, I think it is, 4-1, sorry. Um, gives me a little bit of extra, you know, Every level. This guy's gonna want some beef. He's gonna want some beef? No? He doesn't want any beef? Okay. Then we'll give him some beef. You wanna walk past me with no beef? Waka. Ooh, he took it. He took that fucking beast. Didn't die. That's fine. He died now. Now, um. I'm pretty, there is a, like a keystone down here you can grab, it's right here where these quests are, which is good to grab while you're down here in the first initial quest. Here's another one of those mining picks you need, now I need an 
two or one more. That's too, not too bad. I remember when you used to be able to buy, um, there used to be a, like a trader in here that you could buy like Crowback, um, like you could buy them what they're wearing as a, a, like a fashion item, which was pretty, was pretty pretty cool. I like that. I don't know why they got rid of it. Let's kill this guy. Ah, oh, I forgot to grab this one quest. That's right, I'll grab it later because I've got to kill a yellow anyway. They're pretty hard to kill. So. Damn. Okay, you're dead. Let's go on some. He doesn't want any. Alright, so we can just run past. This guy's gonna want some. We need one more, like, pick before I go up here and these quests in and then end the episode. Pretty sure the episode's going on well past that half an hour mark, but that's alright. Um, it's the first episode, so it's not too bad. It should be fine. Hmm. I didn't know it was this hard to find these goddamn chests. If you know it was this hard, I wouldn't have done the quest. Okay. This this guy don't want to take no damage. He's pretty hard. Alright, let's hope this guy takes a very long time to die for a chest to respawn down there or up here. Now the best thing about this is my sword ability is going up. As you can see. I don't know what this does. I think if it's high it means you can like your shots always hit or something like that. I'm not too sure. Um I'll have to I'll have to look into it more. I forget. Okay, so I'm gonna die from this I think. Oh lucky, lucky, lucky. I know one that feels a bit hard. A bribe. One of those bribe bitches. Alright, so what I'll do is I'll just I'll finish the quest later. I don't get much except for like some XP. Ah, oh, there's one up here. Don't worry about it. Got you guys. So awesome. We got that pick. Nice in rolling. Let's hand this quest into this girl right here. Oh man, sorry. Pretty sure he gives you a sword and axe, as you can see. Weapons, let's equip that one. And the shield for better. Let's drop them as well, just so we don't have them in our inventory, not taking up any space. Now we got a level. Oh no, we didn't. Do we get a skill? Okay, no, we didn't. We didn't do anything. Alright, so let's just walk up here. And the quest into these two guys up here. We got your dog and your mining picks, buddy, so you can continue your mining trip. Now, I'm pretty sure he gives you another mining, like, quest, or it's this, like, lady over here that you have to, like, grab these stones and stuff. But we can do that later. It's a uh, unnecessary run around quest, and it's hard to find them as well. Oh, so they're called laystone fragments. Alright, so we got one more level of that. Now that that's level 20, we can focus on getting that one to level 10. We've got this to level... We've got two of these level like, maxed, and our practice stance needs two more levels, and then it's maxed. So... Let me just run up here. And the quest into this young lady up here. Giving us a quest to go somewhere else. Oh, there we go. So I just want to say thank you guys for watching the first episode of my Celtic Heroes Let's Play of My Warrior from level 1 to 100 and then level 100 to 210 or 230 or whatever it is. And I hope I see you guys in the next episode. Catch you all later.